Three men are behind bars facing federal charges for those their alleged roles in a multi-million dollar drug trafficking organization. Federal prosecutors say the men are connected to a Mexican drug cartel. News 5's Tracy Carlos with the details of how the drugs made it right here to Northeast Ohio. Guns. It was a significant drug trafficking organization operating here in Cleveland. Drugs. We definitely made a large impact on their organization. Cash. As of today, there's three. There will be others. Three men arrested and charged in a 30-count indictment for their alleged roles in a drug trafficking conspiracy linked to a Mexican drug cartel. A pipeline that sent massive quantities of drugs directly into our community has been shut down. A DEA-led investigation that spanned years, one that federal authorities say pumped more than 1,100 pounds of cocaine into the Cleveland area. And they say sent roughly $13 million in drug money back to Mexico. The federal indictment says that cocaine was shipped from Mexico to Northeast Ohio. The feds say it was hidden in secret compartments of tractor trailers and cars and sent to a warehouse on Carnegie Avenue where it was then distributed and sold on the streets. To those drug traffickers, both foreign and domestic, who think that our communities and neighborhoods here in Northern Ohio are open for business, Know that we are watching, we are paying attention, we will act and we will not stand for this. Christopher Ficklin and Robert Atkinson were arrested this morning here in Northeast Ohio. David Gomez Arantia was arrested Friday at the U.S.-Mexican border. Gomez Arantia has also been identified to be affiliated with the Jalisco New Generation Drug Cartel. The DEA investigation started back in 2017, and today authorities told me they expect that more arrests will be made. In the newsroom, Tracy Carlos, News 5.